Today I will be discussing Yes, what I will be discussing? I will be discussing the critical understanding of ICT that is the course EPC 3 which is 1.4 yes and about this I will tell that I will be just explaining from the techno pedagogic skills which is in the unit 4 of the syllabus it's a two-year BA program in West Bengal following NCT regulations 2014 now techno pedagogic skills what is it first of all we have the media message compatibility one can understand the symbolic relationship that exists between medium and message means you are telling something you are communicating there should be a message and there should be a way through which the message will be transferred that is the medium the relationship necessitates a higher level of compatibility if the compatibility is not there then the message cannot be transferred from one end to the other the word compatibility refers to the capacity of existing or performing in harmonious agreeable okay and congenial combination with another or the other now what happens is that when this is done the message will be in the various forms contiguity means being in contact with something communication is a process so this continuity means being in contact with something so you must be having contact with someone or the other to communicate and communication is a process of exchanging information ideas thoughts feelings and emotions through your speech signals writing or behavior whatever through which you can transfer to one another this total communication process where the sender will be there or the encoder who encodes a message and then uses a medium or the channel sends it to the receiver or the decoder who decodes the message because if one encodes the other has to decode the message and after processing information sends back appropriate feedback or reply using a medium or the channel if the channel is not present it cannot be uh, uh, done and there are types of messages also so what are the various types of messages it can be a verbal message and it can be also non-verbal verbal means you know that you're talking you're speaking okay non-verbal you know the sign languages will come now comes the next area that is message credibility what is credit you know credibility this message credibility plays a critical role in a communication process so communication is a total process and credibility comes when it has some objectives of that so it refers to the objective and subjective components of the believability of a source or a message say how much how much accurate or how much uh, this has some uh, uh, value to it traditionally credibility has two major components that is trustworthiness and expertise so trustworthiness you must be trusting on that particular message and must be expertise in that field too according to a particular you must note down the name Falangin and Metzer 2000 credibility of a message 
can be defined as the extent to which a message is perceived or believable, how much it is believable or trustworthiness, that reliability comes in and the trustworthiness and is primarily determined by the quality of the arguments used in the message. Very important. Whenever the message is transferred, that has to be verified also. Now comes the second and the media fidelity. What is it? Message fidelity is an important factor in any communication system. Why it is important? Because it determines the trustworthiness of the media through which the message transmits from the sender to the receiver. So whenever there is a communication, there must be a uh, just sender and there must be a receiver. And now comes the sender, message, medium, receiver, correspondence, how the correspondence comes. So the communication models are organized and logical representation of the process which helps in understanding how communication works can be done. So it will be a model show the process metaphorically and in symbols. It can be symbols also. This is all about the techno-pedagogic skills. Thank you everyone. Thank you. Hope you will just read out nicely and understand the things and these are the tips for your examination. Thank you.